And welcome back guys, GVids here. Just rolling up to my favorite spot right now. I uh, did showcase this a uh, bit just a few days ago actually. Um, but I told everyone that uh, we couldn't run the fish out of the water due to the fact that uh, Rockstar lowered them to one star. Um, it does appear that way, but when you actually pick them up and put them in the satchel, um, they are indeed three stars still. Uh, so I thought I would showcase this spot once again just to show you guys that we can run them out of the water. Uh, but you do need a fishing rod just to spawn the fish in. Um, you don't necessarily need to use it if you don't want to sit there and cast. Um, so simply cast in the water once or twice to get the fish to spawn in. I like to try to get it at least where the fish are spawning. So go ahead, get the fish to spawn in. Once they've spawned in, you can put your fishing rod away if you do choose to do so. Now guys, again, this is just something you want to do when you're doing some collecting or hunting within the area. Uh, just come on over here and run yourself through the water a little bit after you get the fish to spawn in, of course. And we're going to pick them all up nice and easily. As we see, we got a lot of fish in here. So what I try to do is scoot them over to that far little corner there. And they'll probably start running themselves out before I get there. Um, if not, just circle back and kind of keep pushing them towards the front there. I try to pick them up as they die as well. Uh, just that way they don't despawn or sink into the mud. You might lose them. Uh, so just pick them up as you go. It's a little bit easier, I find. Uh, when you do walk, the fish actually get spooked a little bit quicker and easier uh, than when you're running. So just keep that in mind. Just kind of walk your way through. And just keep walking around and eventually the fish are going to start popping themselves out of the water. As you see here, we still get in the largemouth bass, which are $2 a piece. So if you hold 30 of those, that's going to be a quick 60 easy dollars right there. And there's another one. And there's a whole bunch of other little fish here, such as uh, the chain pickerel, redfin pickerel, uh, bluegill, rock bass. So you can load up on a fair amount of different fish. And you don't need to fish and change baits or anything like that. So it's nice and easy. My guy is super hungry. Let's get him a can of beans or something in there. And then continue on our way. So as soon as you see the fish, just kind of walk around them, and they will spook themselves out of the water. Uh, there we got a couple bluegills sitting right there. Beautiful. I think bluegills are worth a dollar a piece, I believe. Um, the chain pickerel are also a dollar. They might be 75 cents, but I'm pretty sure all the little guys are a dollar. It's been a while since I've sold them. Um, but this is a great little spot if you're in the area and you're doing some collecting. Uh, Madame Nazar is actually just behind me right now. Um, so guaranteed you're probably going to be coming through this area eventually um, during the day. Um, again, once I upload this, uh, Madame Nazar may not be there anymore, um, depending on when I get this up and going. Um, but I just want to quickly show you guys that you can come here and you don't necessarily need your fishing rod. If you don't do notice the fish kind of uh, dissipating because you've picked them all up, you can either just go and uh, cast your rod or cast into the water once again and fish will start spawning in. And if that doesn't work, just simply do a quick run away and then come on back, do a cast and the fish should start spawning in for you again. So I'm going to keep uh, keep picking these guys up. Uh, that's two bucks right there. And as I, sh I did show you guys earlier in the satchel there, I was talking through it, but they are actually three stars. Um, so it's completely worth doing this again. Um, this is pretty much the only spot that I can think of where you can really just run out of the water for them. I do know a few other spots, but I haven't been to them in a long time, so I might actually go back and see how those are running. Um, but for now, I'm going to leave it uh, with this, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little spot. If it did, make sure you share, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.